I'm sorry, but it is just, it's blown me away. <laughs> Honestly, it's so, so cute. Well done, girls. The hosts are getting ready in there. But this is the table. So stunning. I don't even know if I can leave early anymore because it's just so nice. I'm supposed to be going somewhere, like, very soon. So I may end up just giving that a miss and staying to support the girls and also mingle. Because I was like, do I really want to rush from this? Not really. Can you come and say hello to the floor? Miss Busybody. Hi. Hostess with the mostess. <laughs> Looking so, so, so cute. Oh, thank you. I'm so happy you made it. Honestly. And now uh, it's been so nice. It's been so, so long since we've seen But look, the sun's out and I've just cancelled my next thing because I'm like, no, it's just, it's way too cute. I, I can't leave. I appreciate leave. you, honestly. I appreciate you. I really you. appreciate you. And I'm so happy for your hair. <laughs> So the girls are coming in, as you can see, and yeah, it's really, really good vibes. I'm really, really looking forward to doing our cakes. So we've all got like our own cakes, and we're all gonna like decorate them. Very exciting. I'm hungry, so I need to get some food at some point. Yeah, phone, vlog, everything. It's over here. You're like. <laughs> I just got the whole thing behind the scenes. Hold on now. This is me. Hasn't done anything. No, look, look, look at her Literally, professionals. Look, professional number one. Number two. Meanwhile, I'm just here. But this looks, this looks really good though. I'm just here. My cake is leaning to the side, but it doesn't matter. So I'm gonna do these and cherries like on there. And then I add glitter, I might add glitter. heartbreak story a week or so ago my friend invited me to watch a screening of three episodes of one day here they are wowing us we did not know what to expect i personally hadn't seen the trailer or read the book so i was just excited to be there i was in for a treat so i thought those three episodes felt like a dream my friend and i could not stop chatting away during the like conversations with the cast we were just obsessed you do not want to miss it. Thanks to everyone in the thank room. Thank you. And once again, thank you to our amazing cast and crew. Obsessed with the acting, the scenes, everything. We couldn't wait to binge watch it. We thought this was so great. Let's go to the after party and we had a good old time. We took pictures. How's the curtain? <laughs> At least we got to laugh because after binge watching it, we both cried and had to discuss it on the phone. Hey guys, so there's my mum in the background. I decided to book us a little hotel apartment because we wanted to have our own like Galentine's night in and I'm actually working with Tesco on this, which is amazing. Like literally I always shop in Tesco every single week. I'm a club card girl. So when they asked me to work with them on their Valentine's Day campaign, I was all here for it. And of course my mum was too. So we've got some really gourmet food from their Valentine's Day like food range. It's really special. Um, we've got steak. We've got really nice meringue desserts. We've got so much, we've got wine. Um, so of course mum's gonna help me film prepping the food and then we're gonna just enjoy the food and also look at my view. I'm in the city. Oh my gosh, the view looks amazing, mum. I'm so glad we chose this one yeah, instead of the other side. side. It looks so good. Look at that. My apartment wasn't ready, even though I've got early check-in. Check my apartment was ready. They had to put me in another one, which was on the other side, had a horrendous view. I was like, look, I just need this for work and I booked a specific room which they actually haven't given me because the room was supposed to have an island and there's no island but we're gonna work with it um but luckily she let me look at this apartment on the other side and this view so much better anyway i need to stop talking to you because i've actually got work to do <laughs> I 
And just like that, our dinner is over. If you want to see how everything turned out, you need to head over to my Instagram where you'll see it. But guys, look at the view. Look at the night view. So cute. My mom's leaving me now. She's got other places to be. She's going out with my godmother and all her girls. And I'm just going to have a nice evening in. I've got the fireplace on. <laughs> and I'm just going to relax and finish the wine and have a good night in. <laughs> Nigeria, please, please win. For the sake of my boyfriend and the, that whole side of my family, please, just do it. They've already scored, literally, as I was on the phone to my boyfriend, they scored. Guys, I have football on in the background and honestly, I came in the bathroom and thought I would unbox this amazing gift from Maison Margiela Fragrances. Um, and I actually feel like crying. <laughs> Let me explain myself. So for a while now, I have wanted to work with certain brands and I have worked with a lot of luxury brands here and there over the years, right? Sorry, my lips are dry, I didn't plan to come on camera. But I want to work with those sorts of brands that I love, that I purchase myself more consistently and not necessarily just work with, but be recognized with and sort of be seen within that realm so i've always always wanted to be on their pr list um maison um margiela fragrances i see amazing girls um be gifted by them work on campaigns with them and i always just, just think like i honestly can't wait for the day that that's me one day hopefully but why me i don't know but i love their fragrances um i have never owned a fragrance from them but i have purchased them for people so one of the first fragrances i ever bought my boyfriend i think it was the first one was by the fireplace by the brand and i absolutely loved it because i wanted it for myself but at the time it was like no this is just a gift so when i received the email that they wanted to give me their new fragrance i was in shock i don't want the night to end without creating something so i'm gonna try and create something and if it doesn't look good i'll redo it tomorrow <laughs> But the fragrance is divine. Like I have been needing something new for so long and I have been easing away from the more unisex masculine scents that I was loving over the past couple of years. And I've been easing over towards more feminine, fruity and girly scents, but in a mature way, if you've noticed that by just the fragrances I've been showing you. Um, and this is literally everything it's everything <laughs> it is so good and i literally was on the floor and i was like when did this become my life i am so overwhelmed this week like i'm having the best week i don't even know what else to say i'm just having the best week and i'm so grateful um there's been a lot going on, you guys, but I finally feel like I'm in flow. I am putting the work in, getting stuff done, but I'm also attracting opportunities, work back. Like I'm literally working with Tesco this evening and tomorrow I'm working with Avon. So that's why tomorrow morning I'm gonna be doing my skincare routine. Like what? <laughs> I'm just so grateful. So it is now time to film my skincare routine. I've got gospel music playing because I feel so grateful right now, you guys. Like the view, the atmosphere, just the fact that I have this work to do. I am so inspired, I'm so excited, and I'm ready for the challenge. So let's do this. <laughs>
guys so i have loaded my car and i'm just gonna go walk and grab something to eat now i've got another hour left on the car park so i thought i would actually maximize it and get something to eat because i'm starving and i've been non-stop working as you know so this fresh air is really really nice Ask my Instagram because I think they might want to get in contact to come back, which I'm not complaining about. So I've got 20 minutes to get to my car. The phone's on 2%, but I'm gonna play a gospel song and power walk, and then I'll see you guys later. Good afternoon, my honey buns. I know you haven't seen my face in a little while. Um, I have been really ill, really, really, really ill, and today is the first day I've gone out. I mean, I did go to a family wedding on the weekend, but I was so ill, <laughs> it was so bad. But at least I filmed the wedding and stuff like that, so I was useful. But today is the first day I've gone out. I had a work call today, um, I had a meeting, I have been doing emails, I've put on makeup, I did my hair last night, back to the short hair. I know you guys are coming for me and you love the short hair, but honestly, I love short hair because it's less hassle. It's maintenance, but it's not. And I am hoping to go a bit shorter anyway. I'm outside a property on a very busy road like you can probably see all the cars going past me it's a country road and the weather is despicable but the property is stunning and I'm hoping I'll be able to film it with decently because it's so rainy you guys so I'm just fingers crossed my phone my camera will capture it well enough and the rain won't look too too bad but I don't know let's see anyway this is what it looks like I'm just waiting for the estate agent to meet me here and let me in i'm here a little bit early so yeah let me show you so there's the house and it looks like of course a bungalow but it's newly renovated it's absolutely stunning of course i'm going to show you guys around when i get in there Oh. the music is brilliant <laughs> but right we're going outside it's raining so i'm gonna wait and then i'm gonna run in hey. oh wow it's yeah, definitely a party house yeah house right it's, it's stunning amazing oh gosh it goes all the way down here it's vibes cartel for me <laughs> anyway this is the annex as you can see, pool table, full kitchen, and two bedrooms and a bathroom. Stunning though, guys, like, whole swing area here. I'm gonna head over there now. Here is the gym. This is crazy. And a little office area here as well. 
also just over here there is a fire pit spacing so over there you get the sunset shine in it's giving real love island vibes isn't it let's have a chat at the fire pit yeah sun shining over to you there's the, the pool, pool area really heated covered. really is love island vibes and we've got your outdoor kitchen over there so you nice. can imagine on a really like nice summer's day because oh it's my south gosh, facing yeah. you can sit out there with a few beers your friends yeah. of course this is lovely honestly just need the weather yeah <laughs> bring the weather here awesome amazing let me get to the back of the house oh, lovely. lovely yeah it's for real i mean you don't you don't know what you're walking into no you have outside. absolutely no idea we to film you doing an intro right guys i have driven to tesco because i fancy tacos for lunch guys i don't want to get out i'm just gearing myself up to leave this car i don't want to do it i have an umbrella but i just don't want to do it guys what how am i gonna do this i have no tights on by the way but it's okay my coat is long I'm gonna bring the umbrella. I'm gonna have to dash over, but guys, this is mental. Like, get me out of this country. Get me out. Good morning, you guys. Another day, another property. So I am in Essex filming some stuff for New Homes Week. And um, shouldn't take me too long. I'm literally gonna just be filming a couple of scenes in different outfits, like loungewear, dressed, drinking a coffee, um, that kind of thing and luckily i will be doing a voiceover so that is the longest part is your scripting and making sure you get all the points in so that's why i love voiceovers because i don't have to worry about that i can do that at home um but the house is really nice it's a four bedroom house um across three floors i will show you guys after i just need to get my work done and this is the garden it's really lovely i'm currently in the like kitchen dining room which has a sofa as well i think i'm also going to try and get some headshots done as well for an article that's coming out uh, that i'm being featured in so i thought i might as well just do all of that now um and yeah let me get to work i'm gonna just leave you guys here somewhere and you can see a bit of behind the scenes a little bit dark in the house um then obviously the natural light is stunning this is the uh living room on the second floor so not ground floor first floor sorry it has a juliet balcony here as well this is the front of the house the main road how big is this room <laughs> this could have actually been two completely separate rooms but i like the space of it because it would be really nice for like a family this is going to be my office this is the office area i'm going to set up here and do a working from home scene but before i do that i need to go downstairs and grab my coffee cup so it's as if i'm bringing coffee and then getting to work now. So that's the plan right now. So let's take the tripod and stuff downstairs. Such a lovely house. Look how wide this hall is as well. And that's a very large toilet. I'll show you guys in a bit. So this is the room you guys saw me in earlier. So now I'm just gonna film myself pretending to make a coffee. So hopefully you guys can see from there. Should be fine. The setup. This is my work from home outfit. This work from home scene was actually just thought of in my mind, and I think it's actually really smart that I brought a dress that kind of looks like it could be for work, plain. So now I'm just gonna pour myself pouring some water into my coffee because there isn't a kettle. I really want to like boil the kettle and stuff, but it's fine. I'm just gonna pour some water into this jug over here. I'm going to turn you here so you can actually see what I'm doing. There you go. Yeah. So, I tested the water at work. You know what I have actually got? A herbal tea. <laughs> see? I'm always thinking about these things. So, I'm trying to take some photos for the press thing that I mentioned to you guys, the article coming out. I don't know if they look good. I'm hoping they do. Otherwise, I have to just try them at home or something. Um, but I just thought this backdrop would be nice. Anyway, I've done a few up here, so I'm going to take all my belongings downstairs 
and try and get a couple downstairs before I head off and I've just posted my Avon work which I am so so proud of and the camera's flashing so let me get these pictures and I'll see you guys oh I'm gonna see you guys tomorrow tomorrow's gonna be a really exciting day yeah see you tomorrow I'm gonna get myself some lunch some Nando's I think for lunch I've done a lot of work this week I've recovered from illness oh it's been a week but yeah I'll see you guys tomorrow <laughs> Wow. Congratulations. You have this very relaxed aura about you. You're just like <laughs> oh. Yeah, all the film. No, don't apologize. I think I'm gonna copy you as well. <laughs> Influencers in the wild, the professional perfumery influencer. <laughs> this is what the professionals do. <laughs> That's what the professionals do, you guys. But I'm like, I'm just gonna copy that. <laughs> Because he wrote a book called Green Card.